Hey family, what's good? Making a quick little snippet video um, about dry shampoos that I use after working out. Scalp gets kind of sweaty up under here. You know, you be working it out, getting, trying to get it together and things. Um, one of the dry shampoos that I use, um, BB Tropical Roots um, Shampoo Spray, has guava and pineapple. It's the bomb. Um, it's a dry shampoo, so you pretty much spray it on your scalp after you're through working out. I tend to separate the hair, spray in between the lines, make sure you get the back real good because that tends to hold all the moisture because that's where all the hair, the, the sweat and stuff, it goes down. Yeah, it's gross, but let's be real. You got to keep it fresh. So, again, BB Tropical Roots Shampoo Spray. Boom. That's one of Tracy's uh, go-to. And these sprays and stuff just help keep my hair um, conditioned, maintenance, you know, looking and smelling as nice as it can within that four to six week period. Some people like washing hair. Um, you can do that if you feel it necessary. You can always go old school and use um, the stringent um, sea breeze. Get you a cotton pad, or I'm sorry, a cotton, little cotton ball and just wipe your scalp down. Make sure you get the little cotton flyaways in between. Whatever works for you, girl. But this is my little shedding light because reviews is news, so I'm going to give all the reviews I can. Um, Cantu Shea Butter. Okay. It's another co-wash spray. I think it's in the same line of dry sprays, dry shampoos. It's part dry shampoo, part conditioner. Um, this one says that it leaves no... I don't know if you can see that. Camera's not focusing but anyway, it says no white powder residue. Some dry shampoos the, tend to be cheaper brands like Suave, which I have. <laughs> um, tend to leave like a white chalky residue from the, and what it is, it's a powder that is deposited on the hair and it's supposed to wick up all the oils and whatnot that are deposited in the hair and the scalp. Um, it's supposed to help kind of dry wash it, I guess. Um, anyway, can too. So this one's pretty good. I have not used it on my favorite list yet, but it's pretty good. And it smells nice, too. Oh, and it has tea tree oil in it, ladies. Yes, which I think has good antifungal hair properties. So that's good. Local hair store price was $5.99. Shout out to Hair Gold. Um, this is <laughs> my cheat because y'all know me and these coins. Okay. Um, but this is... Suave Revive Dry Shampoo um, for all hair types. You can use it without water. Same difference, but this is the chalky residue, so use this sparingly. Keep it all things pushing. I'll holler at y'all later. Peace out.